A week ago, parents of students in the Montgomery County School District voiced their frustrations and concerns about the impending consolidation with Winona schools to representatives of the Justice Department. Well, tonight we hear from the Winona parents. Well, they had the ear of the administration. Our Quentin Smith, Smith, Quentin Smith spoke with the superintendent. He joins us live in the studio for more. Hey there, Quentin. Hey, Scott. A big crowd gathered inside the Winona High School Auditorium as Superintendent Dr. Teresa Jackson addressed parents about the plans for the upcoming consolidation. Now, Jackson says last night the board made the decision to close the Montgomery County Elementary and High School. I spoke with parents during tonight's meeting, and they say they're not opposed to consolidating. They just want the school to do what's in the best interest of the kids and give those coming from Montgomery County a fair shake. There should be fairness, you know, that's what we should see. It, it shouldn't be one sided and right now it feels a little one sided. Nora Dunn has two children in the Winona School District and says she still has a lot of concerns about the consolidation of the Montgomery County and Winona School Districts. It seems less like a merge and more like a takeover and I know with that, you know, some people are going to lose out and it looks like the staff has already lost out and it looks like the children too may lose out. Don was one of the many parents who came out to voice their concerns and questions to the district superintendent. Some raised questions about the safety and security of transportation on the bus routes, while others asked about sports programs and other activities. But their biggest concern was making sure those coming from the Montgomery County School District would have the same representation in the consolidation. Just last week, WCBI reported that teachers in Montgomery County received pink slips and have not been hired to work at the new consolidated school district. The Montgomery County School District in the law is abolished, and um, and so that is kind of the, the procedure that comes about with that. Um, and you, you know, we've talked about some that Winona School District is a B district and Montgomery County is the D district. And so uh, that probably played some in the legislator's decision to write the bill in that fashion. The current consolidated school board is made up of five board members who are all from the Winona School District, which is something else that concerns parents from both districts. However, Jackson says despite the board's makeup, all members will still be accessible and committed to serving all members in the newly consolidated school district. Currently, the board members are all appointed, but um, in November there will be an election and there will be three that continue to be appointed by the board of aldermen for Winona and then two will be elected from the rest of the county. Now, another concern parents raised tonight was about the football team. Now that the schools have consolidated, there's a chance they may have to play in an in independent league, which means they won't have a chance to make the playoffs next year. However, Jackson says they're working and hoping to get that change before the start of the school year. Scott.